from Peoria, Illinois, the uh, Bradley Lab Band, and I'm going to let uh, Doc talk a little bit about what this band is. And please welcome one of our former students, Logan Sanders, up here. Yay! Well, thank you. Well, first of all, um, I, I love jazz night at IBC. <laughs> I look forward to this every year. And uh, this group on stage is called the Groove Project. This is a very unusual group. In fact, we're one of the very few schools in the country that does this. This is not, it, it looks like a big band, but it's actually a New Orleans brass band. And so what we do is we learn all of our music by ear. You notice there are no music stands on the stage. So all this was learned from recordings or just during rehearsals. Um, and it's kind of amazing what we get done. We only rehearse once a week for a couple of hours. And so we're just out of that New Orleans brass band tradition. So we have... Uh, we have some really fun music planned. We're going to do three things for you tonight. We might even feature Logan on one of these. All right. <laughs> Maybe. Um, this first one is called Tome Paul Pinto. This was uh, made famous by the great Barry saxophonist named Leo P. Here we go. This is Liam Hughes.
Thank you. That's Liam Hughes on the Murray Sax and Sam Knoll on Alto. Thank you. Next, we're going to do a tune, a, a very standard New Orleans tune. Um, and this is an arrangement that was done recently by the New Orleans Nightcrawlers, one of my favorite groups. And this is an old tune called Bourbon Street Parade.
can I stand for Andrew and Caden on the trumpet solos? And our vocalist, Rachel, Rachel Rudy, there she is. All right, we, well, this has been a great night and uh, we won't make you stay too long. We only have six more tunes. <laughs> this is our last tune. Uh, thank you to Mr. Chapman for inviting us out. Thank you so much. And all, and all of the teachers here are doing such a great job and it's nice to hear all the bands doing so well. Um, this last tune is, uh, was recorded by Maceo Parker, who is not a household name, but he was actually the music director for James Brown for a long time. And then when he left James Brown's band, he started his own thing, and this is a tune that he did called Shake Everything You Got. And uh, well, we'll see what happens on this one.
Thank you. 